Hey everybody, this is Paul. Welcome to your 26 tutorial in the Intermediate Algebra series. In this tutorial I'll be discussing sets, and a set is basically a group of elements. And so for our case in this tutorial, our elements are going to be numbers. So we'll just put numbers in parentheses here under elements. And one way that we can write a set is by using the roster method. So the roster method is just a nice way to write out all the elements in a set. And the way the roster method looks is you simply have a curly brace on one side, and then you just fill it in with your elements. So we'll fill it in with the elements 2, 4, 6, and 8, and then you simply close it with another curly brace. And you can say that this equals A. And so basically, by doing equals A here, we're basically naming this set, and we're naming it A. So this notation says that set A contains the elements 2, 4, 6, and 8. So we can also create another set here. Let's create set B. And set B will contain the elements 1, 2, 3, and 4. So two things that we do a lot of times when we're dealing with sets is we find the intersection of a set and we find the union of a set. So let's write U here, and this is the symbol that den denotes a union. So we'll put U for union. And an upside down U is the symbol that we use to denote an intersection. So basically, a union of two sets is a set that contains all the elements in both of the sets. So for example, if we were to take A union B, we could also write B union A. It doesn't matter which order we write the A's and B's. It's the same set. And so this is basically the set of all the elements in A and B. So we just simply start writing them down. So we have a 1, we have a 2 in both, and there's no need to write that element twice. We just simply write each element once, even though it's included in both. Now we have a 3. And we have a 4 in both, but we only need to write the 4 once. And we have a 6 and an 8. So this set is A union B or B union A. It's all of the elements that are in either A or B. So on the other, sec on the other hand, we have the intersection. So we can write A intersect B, or we could write B intersect A. And the intersection is basically only the elements that are in both A and B. So it's it's another set here. We'll just put curly braces here. So one only exists in set B but not in A, so we don't include that in our intersection. Two, on the other hand, is in both sets. So since it's in both sets, we write the two down. Three only is in B. Four is in both, so we go ahead and write the four down. And then six and eight are only in set A but not in B. So we just go ahead and close our set here with the closing curly brace. So basically, A union B is the set that contains the elements 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, and 8. And A intersect B is the set that contains the elements 2 and 4. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned for some more tutorials in the Intermediate Algebra series. You guys have a great day, and if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe.